Let us look at this complex uh, linear equation. Uh, first, we'll do it algebraically, and I'll then, then show you how to check it on a graphic calculator. So the equation is solve uh, 3 times x minus 2 over 4 plus the whole thing. I'm not reading it. So the first thing that we are going to do is we're going to find the LCM of the denominators. Okay, so the LCM of 3, 4, and 8. Okay, so the LCM of 3, 4, and 8 are, uh, I know is 24 because 3 goes in uh, 24, 8 times, 4 goes in 24, 6 times, and 8 goes in 24, 3 times. So this is the least common multiple. So what I'm going to do next is, I'm going to multiply each of the numerator by 24. So I'm going to write the numerator like this. So it is 24 times 3 uh, times x minus 2 over 4 plus 24 times x, sorry, this should be 2x minus 3 over 8 is equal to 24 times 2 plus 24 times 1 minus 2x over 3. So this is, uh, you're dividing 24 by Okay, so what you're doing is I'll do one more step for you to understand. So 24, can I write 24 as 4 times 6? So this is 4 times 6 times 3 times x minus 2 over 4. Again, this 24, can I write this as 8 times 3 times 2x minus? I'm doing more steps so that you understand. You don't need to do all these steps. This is, of course, 48, and this 24 I can write as 3 times 8 times 1 minus 2x. Now, the reason we are multiplying by 24 is to get rid of the denominators. So what happens? This 4 and 4 gets cancelled, this 8 and 8 gets cancelled, and 3 and 3 gets cancelled. So what remains is... Uh, that you'll have, you'll, you'll not have the denominators. Okay, so the next step is 6 times 3 is 18 times x minus 2 plus 3 times 2x minus 3 is equal to 48 plus 8 times 1 minus 2x. So what we can do is, now we can expand this. So 18 times x is 18x minus 36 plus 6x minus 9 is equal to 48 plus 8 minus 16x. So let us simplify the left hand side. So the left hand side, so let me write this as 18x plus 6x minus 36 minus 9 is equal to 48, so let me simplify the right hand side, so it's 48 plus 8 is 56 minus 16x. So this is 20, 18x plus 6x is 24x minus 45 is equal to 56 minus 16x. So I want to bring the x's on one side and the, num and the numbers on the right hand side. So I'm going to bring the x's on the left hand side. So I don't want minus 16x sitting here. So I'm going to add 16x to this side. So you do the same thing to this side. I want the numbers on the right hand side. So I'm adding this by 45. So this is also adding by 45. So what happens now? So now uh, this and this gets cancelled. Minus 45 plus 45 minus 16x plus 16x gets cancelled. So what remains is, this is 24x plus 16x is, uh, this is how much, 40x is equal to, this is 56, this is 101. <coughs> so this implies you're dividing both sides by 40, so x is 101 out of 40. Okay, so 
So writing this as a neat number or a mixed number. So this is 40 goes in. Uh, that's how many times? 2. 40 goes in 101 2 times and then you got 21. So this is the final answer. So 21, 21 whole. So if you want to write this as a decimal, which is, uh, uh, so let us use a calculator. So this is 101 menu run, 101 divided by 40, that is 2.525. Okay, so this is 2.525 is the answer in the decimal and in a fractional or in the mixed form. Now how to do this and check it on a calculator. So that's a neat thing that the calculator does it for you, but you need to know how the calculator works. Okay. So let me okay. So so what you do is you go to menu and go to your equation. Equation menu. This is a bit cunning way and then you go to solver and then you have to simply type in this by go three bracket x minus two divided by four. Okay. Then you got plus I put this in the bracket plus two x minus three divided by eight. Okay, so let me scroll this on this side. Then you got an equal to sign, so you go shift. Your equal to sign is here, so you press shift equal two plus again in the bracket one minus two x close the bracket divided by three. Okay, and then you go to solve F6. So that is his answer, 2.525 is your answer. So you'll not understand this, I'll not worry about this. So if you press, if you go through this step, you can check your answer, 2.525. So we are right. Uh, see you in the next.